You gotta be bad. You gotta be bold. You, you gotta, gotta be white. You gotta be wise. You gotta be tough. You gotta be stronger. Yeah. Hello, everybody. Welcome to Drunk Movie Day. This is the day where we drink and go to the movies and get drunk and talk about the movies. Smash that like button and subscribe. Am I right? I'm so old. I'm so incredibly old. I do know that we have a great guest. We've got a great movie. Our comedian today on the show is a stand-up, a very funny stand-up, a very hilarious stand-up, a very professional stand-up. She has traveled the world Traveled the world, made people laugh. Fucking, I heard she killed a guy once. I can't wait to ask her about that. Please put those hands together. <laughs> nope. Please put your hands together for Miss Katie Ellen Humphreys. Hey. Get on in here. Hey. It's me. It's Katie. How's it going, Katie? Never better. Hey. Hey, Katie. Oh, oh, hey, oh. oh I am sweating. Poop emoji. Is that your favorite emoji to use? I'm just, I'm sponsored. You're sponsored by the poop emoji? Mm, I mean, whatever. Do you use the poop emoji a lot? I mean, I talk about poop quite a bit. Oh, you like to talk about scat. Do you find it funny or interesting? I will always laugh at a poop joke though. Of course. Yeah, I mean, I'm human. <clears throat> Katie, you like movies? Been. I think that's a pretty definite answer. I am excited to be hanging out with you. Oh, that's so nice of you to say. I'm excited to be hanging out with you as well. This is what I think is interesting about getting drunk in the movies. Yes. The things that I like to do when I'm drunk. Mm -hmm. Talk. Yes. Incessantly. Mm -hmm. All the time. Yep. Text. Ooh, baby. Incessantly. Yes. All the time. Poop emoji. All the time. Sext. Did you just sext while we're in the movie theater today? I, mean, I don't know. Hey, stop it. All I can see is penises on your screen. <laughs> and you sending poop happen. emojis. Just get a dick pic. Poop emoji. <laughs> what animals are you scared of? Oh, all of them. Really? Yeah. Uh, are you scared of any water-based animals? <gasps> no! Are you scared of any- I'm only scared of land animals! Are you scared of any British tough boy actors? Are you scared of any tough British actors doing battle with any sharks? No! Katie Allen Humphreys, today we're gonna see the blockbuster movie, The Meg. No! Starring Jason Statham, fighting a giant fucking shark. This is the first I am learning that Jason Statham is in this movie. Did you know about this movie? Only just found out about yesterday. Ooh, perfect timing. I also thought that it was about Meg Ryan. I was real excited. It's not. Oh, this isn't the biography about <laughs> Meg Ryan. I'm excited for this. I am afraid of all land animals, but I feel a real kinship with the sea. I'm excited because it's about a giant shark and Jason Statham punching that shark in the face. Oh, you like that, do you? <laughs> It's my Jason Is he Statham. Australian? I'm not good at accents. Aww. To Jason Statham and his Jason dreamy Statham. abs, if he still got them. I put a little lemon lime in there. Mm. Let's swim on out of here. I'm a very strong swimmer. Are you? Are you not know this about me? I'm sorry, about who? What? He's <laughs> kind of got a negative attitude. You on this, you ugly. Megalodon. To prehistoric sharks. We saw the Meg. We're brown bagging it. Yeah. Just like a couple of dirt bags. All in all, I think we can both agree. 10 out of 10. Yeah. This movie. Yeah. A solid 10 out of 10. Yeah. I think I realized that this movie was the perfect summer movie when instead of saying the end, mm -hmm. it wrote Finn. Right? Like a shark's fin. Finn! Yeah. Ugh, where do we start? Uh, Rain Wilson not playing Dwight from The Office. But not not. But not not. No, I thought it was interesting. So at first, I thought it was an interesting choice. I was like, is he a billionaire mm. that for some reason cares about the ocean and the environment? But then he wasn't. And then, but then I was like, wait, is he a billionaire that somehow thinks that you can make money off scientific discoveries in? Because he can't, he's like, this is a gold mine. <laughs> I would have accepted them finding a giant shark and him going, I'm going to be rich, like King Kong style. Like, we're going to put yeah, this yeah, shark yeah. in gonna... an aquarium. I'm going on tour with the Meg. Yeah. Let's play a game. Okay. This game is called, Hey Katie, mm -hmm. how big do you think this shark was? Like, almost infinity big. 
He was almost as big as the ocean. That was my only complaint about the movie, actually. That the shark was too big? Nope. Is that I wanted more out of the water shots of the shark or scale shots of the shark. Again, you wanted the shark to jump on land, grow legs and arms, <laughs> crawl no, into a no, building, no, no. apply for a job at a temp agency, yep. work in a mailroom for six to 12 months, <laughs> get a job as a low level employee at maybe an ad agency, yep. write copy for two to five years, mm -hmm. work his way up. Yes and then become the head of Leo Burnett. Yep. And then they're like, oh fuck, you're a shark! Yes, after he has already fallen in love with the daughter of the owner of the company. Oh boy. But she can't be with him because he lied about being a shark. There was a scene where the baby blue whale came up to the observatory and they go, where's the mother? And then all of a sudden the shark just eats the fucking baby whale yeah. and eats it in half. Yeah, 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 yeah. Which is what I hate about movies like this that are PG-13 because they... No tits. Oh, yeah. <laughs> they didn't show any shark tits. And I'm very no. upset. I was salivating at the thought of <laughs> shark boobies. Because yeah, yeah. as everybody knows, sharks have the nicest tits in the world. Mm-hmm. But people kill them to make soup out of, out of their shark tits. tits. Uh, shark tit soup is <laughs> killing sharks. Yeah, it's a wake up, problem. sheeple. <laughs> There's a line that is in a lot of movies. It's somebody in the field while everybody back at base camp is watching them investigate something. So something cool happens, and then they go, "Tell me you're getting this," and then somebody goes. I'm sorry, what? <laughs> oh, I was writing my blog post. Oh, what? You wanted to capture oh. this momentous occasion? Oh, I thought uh, being the deepest in the ocean ever, I, I didn't know I had to, oh, okay. So hot. She's so hot. She's so hot. We're talking Ruby Rose. She cannot act to save her fucking life. But she can do this. This is a lot of like, this is do a lot do of her Ready? Do 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 is it? Oh, shit. Oh my God, she does do that. You're really a freaking cool friend. <laughs> yeah. Cool. Boom. Um, Ruby Rose. I mean, why they let her talk? Oof. They're just like molded out of things <laughs> for sex. Yeah. Sex mold. Yeah, sex molds. I you... mean, I believe I am currently growing sex mold. That is from lack of... Okay. <laughs> Only... One shirts off Statham scene. I wrote down yummy. <laughs> He's got, and I don't care for this term, but I do not know the actual physiological term for this part of your body. So like the- It's called a boner turing rod. Oh. To show you where the boner is. Oh, I only know it as cum gutters. He looks good. So good. I would love to see him grow out his Fraser? head hair. No. Like Fraser. Oh, baby, I hear the blues are coming. <laughs> Toss salad and scramble abs. <sighs> gotcha! I feel like we have not addressed the love interest angles. Oh, please. Even though there was, like, as we have, we have discussed, Zero tits. There was no sexual contact in this movie. Spoiler. So there were, it was like a, a red herring love interest. Statham is only convinced to come save this mission because his ex-wife is trapped. And you think, oh shit, a reconciliation. Did you not think his ex-wife looked like uh, Rebecca Romaine Stamos? A hundred percent. Right? I was Why was it not? Her. I feel like this is the role that you get though. Yes. If you are a woman who is at, you're like gorgeous enough that you are reminiscent. Yeah. Like, oh, you remind me of someone. Someone I have jerked off to. <laughs> but you are not said person. <laughs> You're an attainable jerk off. That is my brand, 100%. Kayla Humphreys, attainable jerk off. Uh. Was this in the movie or is this something else? Do you not know the difference anymore? Was that movie so immersive that you can't tell the difference? I forget if we discovered Megalodons in real life or not. They were th like, hey, we found something deeper than Mariana's Trench. And I thought they meant the band. And I was like, there's nothing deeper than Mariana's Trench. Oh, my, oh, my, oh, my. 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 O
We've gone beyond Headley territory. <laughs> no one's ever been this deep before. Oh my God. So much cutting yourself. Out of 10 Jaws remakes, what do you give this movie? 9.5, 9 9.5. Oh. Oh, sorry. Nope, I misread it, that's me. I recommend this movie. I do not recommend watching it sober. I've never recommended watching a movie drunk, but this, I get it now. Yeah. I see the For people who are in Vancouver, you are a stand-up comedian. I am. But you are performing in the Fringe Comedy Festival in Vancouver with The Lady Show. Yes, uh, it's a comedy variety show. We like to say that we put the joy in feminist killjoy. Oh shit. Yeah. And we will be doing a run at Vancouver Fringe. We're doing a, a, a be, bring your own venue at the Fire Hall Theater. What? A what a delight. fun day. So fun. What a fun day. We I was saw... real anxious about all the things. Oh Getting no. Drunk, seeing a movie. Except not anxious about hanging out with you. I was very no, excited about of that course. part. That was the only reason I agreed to the other two things. <laughs> but I think everything turns else. Out, I'm a natural of the other two. You are great at watching <laughs> movies and getting drunk. Thank you. Cheers. You're a pro. And yeah. I appreciate you. Well, I have a problem. <laughs> Should I? Yeah, we get. I mean, it's all about to Jason Statham. To Jason Statham. Mm -hmm.